Three quarters of councils in England are turning off or dimming streetlights late at night. It's according to a study by the Labour Party. Councils say it's because they need to make savings as their funding's been reduced. The government says services have been maintained despite spending cuts. Joe Black reports. Midnight and Brentwood is plunged into darkness. Only the Christmas lights continue to shine. This report says for most of the night, 83% of the streetlights are turned off here in Essex. For some, it feels unsafe. You can't go out without a torch. It's quite intimidating to sort of go out and not know what's around the corner. I feel safe with the lights on, to be honest. Yeah, absolutely. No, I don't think they should be doing it to save money. I think it's an absolute disgrace. The county council here says Essex is mainly a rural county and the switch off helps reduce emissions and save millions of pounds. And figures from councils that responded to this survey show Essex is not alone. Since 2010, nine times as many streetlights are now dimmed or switched off. Back then it was 148,000. Today it is 1.3 million. What we've been calling on the government to do, which is to give councils longer term budgets, they can then invest up front to save money later on. But the Conservatives argue some local authorities are actually investing in new lights that are more efficient. Councils are having to make difficult choices. I hope they consider um, road safety, I hope they consider the, you know, the care of an individual, but I'm sure there will be times in a day and in certain locations where street lighting can be turned off. As less money comes from the central government pot, council budgets get tighter, leaving residents to wonder how much longer they'll be left in the dark. Joe Black, BBC News. The accounting watchdog, the financial...